Hello everybody, this is the Bulldozer and thank you for giving me your time and thank you for watching another one of my videos. Here we are with week 5 challenges folks and man it's crazy, we're halfway through the season already. But this week is a special week because you're going to unlock the black outfit for the ninja which is actually called hybrid black clothing. Looks really cool and the other nice thing about it is you can actually change the eye color. You have like a gold color and like a purplish color. So you can go in and change those colors. And I'll show you all that information in the banner video, which you can find in the description of this video. And in two weeks' time, you'll be able to unlock this jacket right here, or coat, whatever you want to call it, from the Black Heart, the white edition of that. And again, like I said, two weeks because you have to have 45 weekly challenges done. When you complete this week, you're going to have 35. When you do next week, you're going to have 42. Then you have to do three more challenges in week seven, and this will be your reward, or one of your rewards, for doing that. And then your next unlock after that will not be until week nine, folks. You have to complete 60 weekly challenges, almost at the end of the season. But when you get to that point in week nine, you'll have to do four of those challenges in order to unlock this hybrid ultraviolet clothing outfit for your ninja. So make sure you stay up to date on all your challenges and get them all completed. And as always, make sure you do these challenges in Team Rumble because it makes it a whole lot easier. 20 people are on one side of the board, 20 people are on the other side of the board. And you can complete the challenges usually without having to worry about somebody shooting at you, which you'll see in this video here. So let's go ahead and get started with our next challenge of Week 5 in Season 8. Now our next challenge is use a volcano vent, a zip line and a vehicle in the same match. Now this sounds like it's complicated, but believe me, it is not. It is extremely, extremely easy to do. In fact, I could get all three of these things done in just over a minute. And could actually did it under a minute if I didn't stop to search two chests. I would have done this challenge in under a minute. So again, this challenge is very, very easy to do. So I'm going to show you the one where I landed and completed this challenge. And then I'm going to show you another one over at Lonely Lodge where you can take and do all three also. That one might take you a little longer. But again, I have to emphasize and I cannot emphasize enough. Team Rumble and LTM where half of the players is on one side of the map and the other half is on the other side of the map. That gives you the ability to complete all three of these items in a short period of time and you don't have to worry about somebody firing at you trying to kill you while you're trying to do this challenge. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, we're getting into this next challenge and this next challenge is use a volcano vent, a zip line, and a vehicle in the same match. Now this sounds very complicated, but believe me folks, it is not complicated whatsoever. In fact, if I would not have stopped to search two chests and pick up a shotgun that was on the ground, I would have done this in well under a minute. But again, I cannot emphasize this enough. Team Rumble, LTM, any LTM where half of your team your team is on one side of the map the other team's on the other side of the map so you don't have to worry about getting shot that is crucial also after i show you me getting the challenge i'm going to show you another location where you can go just in case the bus isn't going over the jungle you'll still have another location where you can drop and actually this location has a has five ballers at that location and i think the one here there's two hangers, and there's two ballers in the left hanger, and there's four ballers in the right hanger. But remember, they don't always all spawn, spawn in when the game starts. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, the bus I'm in is heading over to block, so as soon as it allows you to, you need to get out of the bus and head towards the back side of the volcano. On the back side of the volcano, there are two hangers. In the left hanger, underneath a partially closed door, there is two baller locations. In the right hanger, there are four baller locations. Now remember, just because there's six ballers at this location does not mean six ballers is gonna spawn in here. Okay, but you only need one. So just 
get on the ground and go to your first baller. And you're going to see exactly how fast this is. And again, if I wouldn't have stopped for these two chests, I would have done this in well under a minute. I get in the baller. See, so as soon as I got in, I got, the, I got the check mark. So you don't need to stay in it. But get in the baller, because it makes it faster. Make a hard left as soon as you go through that gate. Stay to the right of the tree. Go towards the back. And you see this little structure back here. There's a chest located in that structure. So go up to the uh, structure. If you want that chest, you don't have to get it if you don't want it. But remember, you're going to hit the vent. So you don't know where you're going to land at. And as soon as you came in, you went straight to the baller. So hit that chest and go up around the corner. This is where I pick up the shotgun that was on the ground. And I'm going to go over here and I'm going to hit this chest right here. So I'm going to move stuff around, get rid of what I don't want. And see, all this is a waste of time if I was just going for, straight for the challenge. I'm going to get on the zip line. And right here, I'm going to hop off the zip line. I've got the zip line done. And now I'm going to hit the vent. And that fast, folks, that challenge is completed. Like I said, if I wouldn't have stopped for those two chests, I would have done this challenge in under a minute, all three locations. Now I'm going to show you another location that's over by Lonely Lodge. Now, this here is in playground, so it's the reason why you're going to see all five ballers here. You don't usually see all the ballers spawned in at one location. But I'm going to get in and get out. And I'm going to go over here and I'm going to hit this zip line. And for whatever reason, I went backwards. I don't know why, but I'm going to hit the zip line again. Ride a zip line. And there's a chest over here. Being we just came in from the bus, might as well go ahead and hit this chest because, again, once you hit that vent, you're going to be gliding again. And you don't know, by this time you're doing all this here, you don't know, you know who's going to be around you because your opponent has got enough time to spawn in next to you. But I'm going to go over here, I'm going to get this quad so I don't have to run. And I'm going to take this quad, I'm going to ride all the way over to the back right hand side of this area and go straight back and you can see this little path right here I'm going to take this path all the way back go in between these trees and there's a little opening and go around this little opening right here and right here is your vent hit that vent and go straight up and that is another way you can complete this challenge but I think the first way I showed you is a whole lot faster there is more cover you're not as, as exposed to if somebody coming in on you, if somebody using balloons or whatever, the first path is a whole lot safer. Found this video helpful, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel for more content, and if you subscribe, smash the notification bell so you know when I will upload my next video. Again, thank you for giving me your time, thank you for watching, I really do appreciate it. This is the Bulldozer. Get your killing on, and I'm out of here.